Once again, Vice President Kalonzo Musioka was selling the yes vote in a church, this time round in his backyard in Mwingi North at Christ the King Catholic Church, Kamongo Parish. Needless to mention, the Catholic Church has already made its stand known, telling its followers to vote no due to the clause on abortion. And other churches. So I wanted to give you that assurance. Kalonzo maintained that the few contentious clauses in the proposed law will be revisited to the satisfaction of everyone after the passing of the new law at the referendum. <laughs> Meanwhile, Nairobi Metropolitan Minister Njeru Gidai and Sports Assistant Minister Kabando Wakabando went to Runyenje seeking to pour cold water on the message the No Team may have imprinted on the minds of the people here yesterday when it made forays into the area. But we are not going to accept any more lies that CDF is going to be abolished, that Latif is going to be abolished, that if you have less than two acres of land, the government will take over your, your land. The and patriotic posturing that can come handy when people become a basket of desperandos yeah? and relenting in their complaints instead of embracing what is irreversible. The legislators welcome the arrival of the U.S. Vice President Joe Biden, who is here to impress on Kenyans to embrace reforms by passing the proposed constitution. Sylvia Tibet, Citizen Live at Night.